Today I'm going to show you how you can turn your simple flip-flop slippers from something like this to a beautiful and simple crochet slippers like this. So without further ado, let's get started. You will keep this one aside. We are going to prick the slippers around about half of an inch with a sharp object like this. So you repeat the same thing round to this side. So after pricking it round, so I'm going to make three single crochet in each of the prick holes. So you tie a slip knot, insert your crochet hook and pull it through. Yarn over and pull through to attach the thread. Insert again. Yarn over and pull through. Then you pull through the two loops. One. Insert in the same place. Yarn over and pull through. Pull through the two loops. That's two. Insert again, yarn over and pull through, yarn over and pull through two. We have three loops in this place. Insert in the next place, yarn over and pull through, pull through the two loops. One, insert, yarn over and pull through. Pull through the two loops two. Insert and over and pull through. Pull through the two loops three. So you move to the next place again and make three single crochet. So you are going to keep repeating three single crochet round until you come back to this place where we first started. We are going, at the end we are going to slip stitch to this side. Then cut off the thread and hide the excess thread behind. Next you tie a slip knot. Insert your crochet hook and start knitting.
so after the last single crochet on this side you draw it a bit turn your thread like this to this side and turn this this loop turn this loop back to this side then make one single crochet draw it a bit on these loops that are on this side these loops that you can see from here you are going to insert your crochet hook back into this side and over and pull through you have two loops on the hook pull through the two insert in the next loop yarn over from behind and pull you have two loops on the hook then you pull through the two So you are going to keep repeating the same thing. I'm just going to keep repeating the same thing to the end. So if you're getting any value from this video, please kindly hit the like button and consider subscribing because on this channel I teach simple crochet DIYs and recycling tutorials. And thank you if you have done so already. So you keep repeating the same thing to this end. So at the end you make chain one and cut off the thread. So after we finish this one, we are going to start with this lacy side. So you are going to tie a slip knot like this and turn it this way. We will be doing the lacy side from the inner side here. So Apart from this middle loop here, count one, two, like this in the second place, insert and attach your thread. Then make three chains one, two, three. Count one, two by this side and attach like this. Make one single crochet. In the next loop, insert. Make another single crochet. Insert in the third loop. Make another single crochet. After you turn your work, make four chains. One, two, three, four. Attach in the middle. Make one single crochet. Then make four chains again. One, two, three, four. 
attach in the next loop here. Make one single crochet. Make another two single crochet in the next two loops. One. And two. Make four chains again. One, two, three, four. Turn your work. Attach in the middle of this chain four. I make one single crochet. Make four chains again. One, two, three, four. Attach in the middle of the next chain four. Using one single crochet. Then make four chains. One, two, three, four. Insert in the next place and make one single crochet. Make two more single crochet in the next two loops. So one and two. Then you make four chains again. One, two, three, four. Turn your work. Attach in the middle of the last chain four. And make one single crochet. Make four chains again. One, two, three, four. Attach in the middle of the next chain four. Make four chains again. One, two, three, four. Attach in the middle of the next chain four. So you make four chains. One, two, three, four. Attach in the next loop. Make one single, two single crochet in the next two loops. One and two. So you are going to keep repeating the same thing. So I make a total of nine rows. So you cut off your thread and hide the excess behind. So after this, you are going to turn it. This is the right side and this is the wrong side. So we'll turn it this way and start single crochet from here down to this end. Inside the chain four spaces, make two single crochet, one and two, one and two. So. 
so at the end we're going to make three chains one two three and two yarn over insert yarn over pull through pull through two and pull through to one insert in the same place pull through pull through two and pull through to two yarn over insert pull through pull through two and pull through two so i've done three double crochet in the same spot so after the third one skip one two insert your crochet hook in the third place and make a slip stitch then yarn over and insert make three double crochet from in the fourth loop skip one two insert in the third place and make a slip stitch yarn over insert in the fourth and make three double crochet one two three three skip the next two insert in the third make a slip stitch so you are going to repeat the same thing to the end of the row here At the end, make a slip stitch here. Hide the excess thread. So we're going to repeat the same ruffle that we did here on this side. But we we'll use a dark blue thread so you insert from here attach your threads they make three chains one two three in the same space make three double crochet one two And three. You're going to skip two loops. You're going to skip two loops. One, two. In the third place, insert and make a slip stitch. Then yarn over again in the fourth place, insert and make three double crochet. One. three skip the next two loop one two in the third place insert and make a slip stitch and over insert in the fourth place and make three double crochet We are going to keep repeating the same thing to the end.
so you are going to keep repeating the same thing to the end so at the end you slip stitch cut off your thread and hide the excess so after we finish we are going to insert it back into the sleeve first So the next thing we are going to do is to make this flower on top here. So we are going to tie a magic ring. Wrap the thread around your two fingers and cross. Insert your crochet hook and pull through. Then make one chain. You can adjust it like this make two more chains one two then we are going to make 14 more double crochet inside the magic ring one three four now you can adjust the magic ring so after the 14 double crochet We'll slip stitch to the top of this chain three. Slip stitch and cut off the yarn and hide the excess. Next, tie a slip knot. Make three chains. One, two, and three so in the same space we are going to make five more double crochet one two three Oh. Five. Then you pull the thread, remove your crochet hook, come back to the first chain three space, insert and pull through. Then make one chain. Make two more chains, one, two, over again. Keep one of the loop in the next loop. Make six double crochet. Two, three, four. Five. and six. So you pull. Come to this place where you started from, insert your crochet hook and pull back to this side. Make one chain, 
make two more chains one two so after the last one make three chains one two three and you connect to this place with a slip stitch out of the yarn and hide the excess after the pink we are going to do the white this one you can see pull through again to attach make three chains one two three make six double crochet in this chain three space plus the chain three making we are going to make five more double crochet in the first instance three four five and six including the chain three so you remove your hook after the sixth one and start it just like the way we did in the previous row pull through make one chain two chain then you repeat six double crochet in the same space again one So three four five and six pull the thread and start in the first place where you started from. This time around you're going to make three chains one two and three then you cross to this chain three space and make six double crochet one two three four five and six pull your thread insert in the first place insert here again and pull make one chain Two chains then you repeat the same thing again six another six double crochet one two three so you are going to repeat the same thing round until you come to the last chain three space so I'll meet you at the end. After the last puff, make the chain three and attach to this side. With a slip stitch. Cut off the thread and hide the excess. So after we are done, we are going to use needle and thread. Place it like this. Use needle and thread and attach it. So I'll do it off camera when I'm done, I'll come back. So friends, at the end, this is how the slippers look so gorgeous. I really love it. And if you love this tutorial, please give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing. If you have not yet subscribed and leave a comment for me down below. 
and thank you so much for watching bye bye see you in my next video